Welcome back to another grocery haul. Today's grocery haul is from multiple different stores. Walmart, Albertsons, Kroger, Tom Thumb. Everything's all mixed in together. I'm going to start with the cold items first. Alright, so let's start off with some turkey bacon. We've been really enjoying the Oscar Mayer turkey bacon. And it's a healthier option for us than regular bacon since we're on a healthy lifestyle. I'm going to make pinca de gallo this weekend. So I got some cilantro, a jalapeno, a red onion, and some Roma tomatoes. Meats wise, I got some organic chicken. A roast. I can't wait to cook up the roast in the crock pot. Dickie's barbecue sausage. I found this at Walmart. So Walmart and Kroger carries this. Some people have been asking me about where we found this uh, Dickie's barbecue sausage. Kroger and Walmart. And got some ground turkey. More chicken. And pork chops. We love pork chops. Two dozen eggs. Some more biscuits. Ryan likes to make biscuits and gravy on the weekends for him and Steve. Four more of my strawberry fruit strips. French fries. These are the crinkle cut. One vanilla Yoplait yogurt. Now for a side dish just to go with our dinners. I got some frozen Brussels sprouts. I've had Brussels sprouts before. They're okay. But um, this is just easy, frozen, thaw them out, cook them up on the stove. And then we also got some broccoli cuts. So that'll be good. We'll give those a try and see if we like them with our dinners. More snackers. We got the Black Forest ham, and they finally had the rotisserie chicken in stock. So I stocked up and got three of each. And for Ryan, he wanted a frozen pizza for dinner or snack sometime. And then he also wanted a Marie Callender's apple pie. He's been wanting to try these, and I think that we'll all three share this and see how we like it. Special treat. More of his extra sharp cheddar cheese, and then lastly, some string cheese. So those are all the cold items. I'm going to put all this stuff away and then continue on with the rest. Moving on, got some vodka from the liquor store. Three bottles of the Moscato wine, one for each night. So one for Friday night, Saturday night, and Sunday night. Some more of my Diet Cranberry juice. This was a find. Hickory and brown sugar barbecue sauce. I cannot wait to use this like on chicken and pork chops and also in my meatloaf or on top of my meatloaf. This is good. I can't wait to use this. The Complete Cookie, I've seen these in the stores before and I thought I would give them a try. There was a channel that won an unboxing and some of these cookies were in that unboxing. So I'm really excited to give these a try. The Suet Bird Feeders, I have two in the backyard. So I picked out the High Energy and Peanut Treat. So the birds are really going to like that. Paper Towels. Three old-fashioned pecan pies for Ryan. I was really sad that they were out of the apple because the apple is my favorite. But for Ryan, he really likes the pecan pies. Scoops potato chips for the Pinka de Gallo I'm going to make this weekend. Two cans of tomato sauce. Rice side dishes. I got the chicken. rice a Spanish rice. Top ramen for lunch sometime this week. And then some more of my Cocos. Found those at Walmart again. And then lastly, I found some butt rub at Walmart. Now, I haven't heard that butt rub was carried in stores. But I found it at Walmart. I can't find it at Kroger. And back in the day, you could only get this stuff online. So, I don't know how I spotted it. But it's in the spice section at Walmart. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys know what butt rub is. But it's already opened. I got this yesterday at the store and I used it on my pork chops and boom, was it good. It was so, so tasty. So I'm really excited that I found this. So you guys, that's the end of the grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and we'll see you in the next grocery haul.